LeBron James is about to dunk against the best of the best in high school hoops. But the real challenge for LeBron will be with history. It all began in 1987 with the likes of Larry Johnson. And through the years, we've seen cartwheels, poses, hurdles, Kobe, even Vinsanity. But we think he can handle it. And those were in games. All right, we're with LeBron James. And LeBron, do you, do you have a kind of a pre-programmed dunk menu for us? You're going to kind of go with the moment. No, it's funny you ask because uh, everybody be asking me, and I'm just going to go off the top of the head. Whatever comes to me, you know, before I'm about to do my performance, you know, that's what I'm going to use. But I don't have nothing scripted out. I'm just going to go off the top of the head freestyle. Uh, I saw you talking with Darius Miles just a few minutes ago. Uh, did the NBA or have a couple uh, pointers for you, perhaps? No, you know, me and D Miles is real cool, so we were just talking. He said that every dunk I was going to do, even if I did between the legs behind my back, he's going to give me a two. So that was <laughs> kind of funny, you know, but, you know, it's just all fun. We just have, have fun here at the McDonald's game and trying to enjoy this. All right, I'm offering my services as a prop if you need me later in the evening. All right, good luck. All Dave, right, we'll Dave. send it back to you. Well, here's our first dunker of the evening. And Duty Ebby out of Houston, Texas. Six foot nine, can you believe it? we had so many big people here today, Tim. Yeah, yeah, and look how long he is. Now, this is going to blow you away. Andy told me that his first dunk was in fifth grade. Oh, my Are God. you kidding me? <laughs> I mean, most fifth graders, they're, they're barely getting their training wheels off their bike. How much pressure do you put on yourself? You're the first guy. I mean, the jitters, you, the juice has got to be flowing even a little bit more here when you're the first guy up. Goodness, uh -huh. there's some serious ups there. <laughs> Standing ovation from a lot of the women, too. <laughs> yeah, I like that a lot, but don't you think the judges need to save those tens? 163 points for the first round. On Wafer out of Cleveland, Texas. He's headed to Florida State. Play for Leonard Hamilton. Now, no lack of confidence from Vonnie. He said, I've got a little bit of Vince Carter and Dominique in my game. Got that one. He almost stuffed himself. But we'll give him credit for that. J.R. Giddens, he's got the folks on their feet already. Let's see if he can live up to the advanced height. <laughs> That's a winner anytime, any place. Put up a 10. Oh, man. Forget about it. Power guard, six foot six. Next year, Kansas Jayhawk. <laughs> it's hard to think that, let alone do it. Favorite dunker, Dave? Kobe Bryant, Jason Richardson. See what he does here. Now, I know who's going to like that. Larry Nance. Larry Nance, <laughs> <Absolutely>. exactly. <laughs> you know, that's going for the nostalgia points. Nothing wrong with old school. He is your clubhouse leader. Here's Shannon Brown out of Maywood, Illinois. He's going to play at Michigan State for Tom Izzo. Yeah, I think you're going to notice him a little bit like a former Spartan, Jason Richardson. Ooh, nice one hand. Thought about this one for a long time, didn't he? Yow. <laughs> Man. Hey, you know how he's able to pull that off? This kid has some of the biggest guard hands that you're gonna find. He cups, that's Julia serving vintage. I mean his hand, when he buys gloves, he must be looking at about a size 13, 14. Look at that. It's like you're thinking of baseball. That's a guy that takes his dunk seriously. He said, you know, over the course of the night, you can expect a two-hand windmill, a little bit like Vince Carter. I'm going to go through my legs like J.R. Ryder, and I'll give you a little up and down like Tracy McGrady. Ooh, there's your windmill. Well, LeBron James is taking his jersey off, so you know he's next. Uh-oh, uh-oh. 163 points, currently in fifth place. The man is ready. This is why we're here. 
LeBron James ready to get going. Yeah, I'm, I'm afraid he may jump out of his britches. Uh, yeah, that's right. He's got the he's got the shorts riding kind of low, so <laughs> it's not going to take a long run up. Oh my goodness! <laughs> that was the first one. Wow. Are you? Oh man! You know, I was going to say Vince Carter like elevation. That's higher than Vince Carter. <laughs> Settle down, Dave. Settle down, partner. <laughs> you know what, though? So smart because how much does he have to do to advance? He's he's working the crowd to the fever pitch. Beautiful delivery of the ball. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, I, I like it. I tell you, I've, I've seen a lot of these, Tim. We, we've done these a bunch of years. But, I mean, so fluid, smooth, powerful, graceful. I mean, just amazing. Well, he's going to sit on that, huh? Here's Shannon Brown. He'll get us started here in the finals of the dunk contest. Went for 165 on the first round. Yeah, and that one-hand windmill, tremendous. I think that Shannon Brown may have challenged in the three-point contest as well. Oh, well, it have been going down. I'm going to do the old foul line deal. Is that Shannon Brown or Julius Irving? Oh, that'll work. That will work. Oh, brother. He may not have got anything in the first two, but ring the bell on that one. Sonny Hill, Garf on down the line. Gracious. <laughs> it's one thing to do the Irving dunk taking off, but to do a 360 smile halfway. Oh, yeah. This little David Thompson. Yes, sir. So a combo, David Thompson, Julius Irving. Once again, if you make your dunks, you've got a chance. That's right. You go with the simple stuff. That's what LeBron James did, too. Oh, he switched with the left hand. That was nice. There wasn't a biggie. Athletically, he's, he's still ahead of 99% of the, of the country. Up next is Von Wafer. There's the power of Dominique. Long pondering here. Let's see what he's got. Oh, yeah, that works. Yeah, Kobe gets a lot of credit for that, but it was J.R. Ryder back in the day. Here's Wafer. Last chance. Nice. <laughs> Went hard. The power done. Uh, LeBron, you told us before the competition, you didn't have anything planned. You're just kind of wing it. You've had a lot of time to think about it. You got some premeditated options right now? Well, you know, I'm a dunker that really doesn't think about what I'm going to do, you know. I just go out there, and whatever happens when I'm in the air, what happens, you know. And I hope I get a good ovation from the crowd. Very poised, LeBron James. Yeah, I'm not worried about him winning the contest. I'm afraid the guy's going to bang his head on the rim. <laughs> Honest to goodness. The boys, young man, 6'8", 240. He's trying to get it. I think he wants a different song right queued up. Say what, he, he's, he even has, I mean, at 18, 19 years old, he's got a deep voice, <laughs> Tim. You better watch out, pal. And, and he's, he's changing things. He, He's the DJ Dunker. Uh, this, he is the favorite son in this part of the country. Look out. Oh. Oh, hey, you know, the amazing thing about LeBron, you know, he's experienced, and his first dunk was when he was in eighth grade in one of those teachers versus the students game. Imagine that, Dave, a 14-year-old dunking on his math teacher. Boy, probably probably carried the sentiments of a lot of his classmates. Dave, I have never seen anybody jump as high as LeBron James. It, it, it's a scary, and you know that takes in a lot of folks over the last 25, 30 years. Yeah, how about David Thompson, Dr. J, Michael Jordan? This guy is in elite company. Go. Golly, his head, his chin almost hit the rim. <laughs> Incredible. He's only getting nines. 
But he's doing what you said. Get the points, and now he can. He probably goes for the, the, you know, the showstopper I, right here. I expect something very sick right now. Yeah. Look at his head. Look at that. Oh, man. We might even see it take the corner off the top of the backboard. Here comes the third attempt. Well, he got that up high. Did that go in? That's a horse shot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do that again. And throw out again, too much lead time. This guy's loaded, isn't he? He can bounce it off the floor. He can dunk it. I don't like these dunks as much because I think it's really hard to complete I it. I agree. Well, if you do nail it, God bless you. Look out. Wow. Oh, man. man, he had to <laughs> wait for it. What's up with that? Uh, he didn't put up huge numbers. Oh, yeah. I mean, he was, I don't think he had one eight in, the, in those in that series of dunks. Look at this. Look at it. You see, double clutch. <laughs> When's the last time you saw that? A double I've clutch. Never seen he it. double clutched. You know, he That's went up. He went. He was up around 11 feet. 11 feet. Watch. He hits the second gear right there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. That's remarkable. Well, there's your leader. 250 points. If you can hold on to it, that was a good looking attempt. Oh, you know what? There's a case. Hands aren't big enough. That's right. And Giddens, you said he's got the broken bone. He's limping off right now. I think he's going to bag right now. I guess we've got a champ, don't we? Yes, indeed. Comes as no surprise. Just like Ronald Curry. Ronald Curry defended his turf. So does LeBron James here in 2003. LeBron James is your winner of the slam dunk competition here in Cleveland. LeBron, it's so difficult to live up to the expectations, right? I mean, the, the crowd expects you to fly over the backboard and throw something between your legs. A, a difficult competition for you? Well, you know, anytime you can get some athletic players across the country to be in the same competition and uh, same event as you, you know, it makes it more competitive. And I liked it tonight, and I'm, I'm glad I came away with the, with the trophy. Good. Congratulations. Good luck next season, wherever that uh, may be. All right, thank you.